Hi, my name is Vasu. And for those who can pronounce it, Vasudev is coming out. I am a Malayalam, which means these days though I live in Montreal doing a PhD in chemistry. But don't worry, this video is not going to be a science lecture. Let's go to the lab. Much better. So here is the deal. I work with blood and urine samples. Not in a creepy way, I promise. I study them to figure out what's going on inside people's bodies. Every drop of blood or urine is full of molecules. These molecules tell us, "Hey, this person just ate," or "Something's off in this liver," or even, "This person might be having a bad mood." But they're too tiny to see with naked eyes, so I use a tool called LCMS or liquid chromatography mass spectrometry. Basically, it's just a fancy scanner that can look what's in a sample and how much of those things are there individually. I work in a field called clinical metabolomics, but don't worry about the name. Metabolome is the complex biochemistry that goes inside your body, and X is just study of. I study these small molecules because they carry signals. They can more or less tell us anything and everything about your body. So my job is to look at these molecules in your blood and urine and try understanding how they are connected to your bigger health, your energy, your mood, and sometimes even your brain. It's like solving a mystery but using biochemistry. You see what is there? Anyway, here is how a typical analysis works. We take a tiny sample, just a few drops, spin it fast in a centrifuge like a mini washing machine. then inject it into the lcms first the machine separates all the molecules in your sample like sorting skittles by color then it weighs every molecule super precisely the result a graph full of peaks each peak is equal to one molecule i carefully look at each peaks figure out what's what and what it means basically a typical day for me is not dramatic There is no explosions or sudden eureka moments. Most days it's pipetting, waiting, squinting and more coffee. Sometimes the machine crashes, sometimes your sample is leak, sometimes you realize you've been analyzing the wrong file for 3 hours, but once in a while the data just clicks. Science simply doesn't happen in big eureka moments. It happens in tiny steps. One study builds on another. One researcher builds on years of someone else's work. Almost nobody is inventing anything new from scratch. It's standing on top of a long ladder of people who came before them, so everyone can see a little further. There is no giant government control room where all science happens. No secret science overload. It's just a bunch of tired, curious people like me trying to figure out small pieces of a very big puzzle. So yeah, I am Vasu. I wear a lab coat. I use expensive machines, but I also forget where I keep my pen all the time and I always drink too much coffee. I really believe science should be less scary, less for experts only. It's not magic. It's just curiosity, method and a lot of patience and it belongs to everyone.